it is Sunday the 30th of April and I'm starting my day off at lunchtime. So, believe it or not, there is three punnets of chestnut mushrooms in here that I'm frying down. I'm making myself, Warren and my mother, an omelette. One of the kids will run down with her omelette. Um, and they're having pizza because I don't want mushroom omelette. So, I'm literally going to do just some mushrooms and some cheese. I've also been given some fresh farm eggs and they're massive. So I think they might be double yokers. So I shall see, but I will just, oh, that is hot, that pan. I will just weigh the egg and then I will see if it's a double yoker. And then if it is, I can count. Obviously, I'm, I'm, I think they've got double yokers on the, you know, I'll need to check, but I'll double check. But yeah, that is what lunch is gonna be. I'm just making my mother's omelette first, and as you can see, that was a doubler. Everybody's fed now, I'm just finishing off mine. So 422 calories this omelette's gonna be. So I've just cooked the bottom in a pan and I'm gonna stick it in the ice cool now just to brown off the top and cook it through. This is my omelette. I am gonna add a bit of tomato sauce onto it in a minute. So I will add the calories on the screen for everything. I'm also having a bag of Walker's um, lightly salted crisps. And I'm gonna finish off with one of these orange and caramel delights. So I am actually off to bingo with my friend Deb um, tonight because we're going to be watching the football so I'm going to go and win some money. I've actually got a salad, pasta salad from Tesco so I'll be taking that for my tea um, but that is what I'm having for my lunch. So, whew, busy afternoon. Right, that um omelette I had was delicious, I have to say. Um, right, I am just off to pick up my friend Deb and we are going to bingo to hopefully win some cash, yes. I've got no makeup on, I haven't done my hair, I've still got my glasses on my head. You know you don't care, but I finally painted my nails. I hate going around with chip nails. And I lent my friend Jess my top and base coat because um, she was doing her nails and I found my old ones. So I've done gel nails in a light colour because I've been a bit mm, like fed up and stuff. I've actually bitten my nails a bit. I haven't bitten them like I used to bite them. They're just shorter than they used to be. But it's still all right, you know. And now I've put gel nails on. It'll stop me biting them now so they won't go down any shorter. So I've left Warren and the kids all their food. You know, good, good wife and good mother like that. I've got a salad with me. Although the food demons are at me this week, let me tell you. I could quite easily just sit and eat a load of rubbish. I really could. I am absolutely sick of food. I hate food. Food is my absolute enemy at the moment and I'm not happy about it. So I'm gonna catch up with you a little bit. Morning. What happened? Again, I just, I just didn't get around to finishing my bingo. My video even, or my bingo. We didn't win 5,000. It was a special um, night last night and the house, the last house was 5,000 and some lucky young girl won it on her own. <gasps> lucky thing. Anyway, it's the 1st of May. Five months of the new year and what have I done? Weight-wise, not much, not much. I had that pasta salad last night in bingo, which was all right, like it was day out of date, but I still had it. <laughs> and then I had a pack of um, mints, Maynard's mints, and I didn't count them. 
But I had 800 and something left and I think that would have just about covered it. So, 1st of May, ending this video. 1st of May's video will start tomorrow. As you know, as I work a day behind, I've literally just taken out the freezer some cod and some sea bass. And I've got a nip to the shop, so I'm going to get some potatoes. And I'm going to do like, um, I'm going to make like a pasta sauce or a cheese sauce. Um, I've got quite a lot of milk to use, blue top milk that I picked up to use. So I think I'm going to make a homemade cheese sauce. I'm going to do like mashed potato and some veg with the white fish and then like a cheese or pasty sauce. And I've just also taken out um, sausages out of the freezer and um, I'm going to do hot dogs for lunch with onions. Mm. So I've got a few hot dog rolls that need using up. And I need to start using the stuff out of my freezers because I keep putting stuff in there and never use it. So, hmm. And I cooked a sweet potato the other day. <laughs> I still haven't used it. And it's in the fridge. And I'm determined I'm not going to throw it out. And in the Hairy Dieters book, um, there was this sweet potato tea loaf can't remember the name of it, but it was like a sweet potato tea loaf. So, kids are back in school tomorrow. While they're in school, I'm going to make that tea loaf. So, I shall bring you along to that. As long as the sweet potato hasn't gone um, funky, you know. But, uh, yeah, we're having a lazy day. And it feels like Sunday to me even though it's Monday it feels like Sunday and I'm sitting in my car because I am just about to drive yes drive to my mum's oh there's a house for sale across the road and there's viewers um having a look and I'm sitting in my car talking they're in a swanky Range Rover Mm. New neighbours. There's two houses for sale in my street, but they're, they're not, a lot of money they are. A lot of money. I thought they would have sold by now, because where we live is a really good um, area for the schools and things and for getting onto the M4. And it's quite desirable to live to live here but we won't be here forever because once anything happens to my poor old mum we're off to see the wizard now we're gonna go and find a nice bungalow somewhere whether that will be in um the immediate time or whether that will be in 10 years time who knows old flosso could live till she's 100 so it could be in 20 years time will i still be here in 20 years will i still be on youtube in 20 years i doubt it because i will be what will i be then 46 <laughs> oh god i'll be nearly 70 Jeez. Anyway, I'm going to go now to my mum's. She only lives down there, but because my legs hurt, I drive to her house. <laughs> and I always think the neighbours probably think, oh, look at that lazy cow. Can't walk to her mum's. But my knees are that shot. Walking to my mum's is just, ugh. So I drive down. Right, oh, and I've got the lovely task of trying to sell sell the um, Astra tomorrow as well. I've got to take it to Ponty to be washed. I ain't washing it. I've cleaned out the inside. It's sparkling. 
I'm going to take it to Ponty to be washed and then I'm going to polish it up. And I'm going to stick it on motorway and see what happens. Because I had a good experience with motorway selling my mother's car. So I'm going to try them first. And as long as I have enough money to clear the finance that's left on it, I don't care. I'll just sell it for whatever. Be nice if I had a little bit of change in the bank, you know, but I doubt it, knowing our luck. We don't have much luck with cars. Right. I shall uh, be off and catch you tomorrow, guys. Catch you tomorrow. I'll catch you tomorrow to let you see what I've been up to today, which is not going to be much, but we're going to stick to calories and we're going to we're going to do this. We are. I hate food. I do hate food. The food is the devil. It is the devil. Right, guys. Catch you on the next one. Bye.